they got her cracked. Apparently, you have to take them all the way out. Got to pull a, had a wrench on the, the end of the screwdriver there. I'll try to crack them free. Either there's nothing in the carburetor, or I have to pull the screw out, or the holes are plugged. Either way, you know what? Heck with it, I'm already, I'm already here. Let's pull the, pull the thing off. Oh, I see some wetness. <laughs> it's moist. I'm gonna put the rag in there. Just wanna see if I can get this. Get these bugbears off again. Oh, I did crack it. I didn't think I did. Thought that screwdriver slipped off. Okay, well, let me get the rag back in there. Oh, here we go. There's lots of fuel in here. Way more than that front bowl, so possibly that front bowl has gunk in there, blocking the drain hole. Might have to go back to it. Oh, yeah. Get that drain. Yeah, I want to go back to that front one. With the amount of fuel that's draining out of this one. Okay, I'll get back at you. I'm going to jump back to this front one. All right. Pull the screw all the way out. There we go. I missed the onslaught of fuel. It's because I put the camera down, but... So this uh, little, oh yeah, she's got garbage in it. Oh geez, that's not a good sign at all. This has that grunk gunk in it, I bet you the jets do too. Oh man. <laughs> okay, so see that? Yes. Okay, so it's not very promising, but I will carry on. Like I said I got overall kit. Let's pull this guy out. I did get quite a few, quite a bit of fuel out of it. Some still sitting on the engine. I'll wipe that up. I kind of slipped off of that. Not very, very good. Gonna beat the screw up a bit. All right. Well, I'll throw this back in. Go to the other side, and uh, that's not promising at all. <laughs> oh well. Oh, damn it! Oh, wait a minute. <laughs> no way. Uh, as fluke as can be. I'll accept it though.
You know what, seeing that, I wonder if I should pull these uh, carbs off. Struggling with that thought. Maybe I should. Because I have the kits. They're literally over sitting over there on that roof of that car. <sighs> Darn it. I think I already know my answer. All right, the decision to uh, pull the carbs off might have been a good one. There's garbage in there. You can see that very well. The air cleaner was in it. It was not, it's not that bad. But that's a lot of junk in there. And I just, just took the air cleaner off. It wasn't sitting open. So... All right, the plot thickens. We will put these guys in then. A baggie, an expensive baggie of stuff. I'm waiting for a power valve. I didn't order a power valve. I thought it came with the, the parts kit. So I ordered one of them. Uh, got a battery in it. Overhead set. I'll let it hang and chill for a bit. I know I got the engine sitting open in my garage. Probably should cover it up, but drain the last bit of the oil out of it. I should put a thermostat in it. New timing belts are done. Cam and crank seals done. Compression test is good. Well, goodish. <laughs> There's quite a variation on some of the cylinders, but. I think we'll be fine. All right. Sweet. Vacuum line right here. Goes to the ignition system. I have a vacuum pump. I could uh, confirm. Ooh, this is exciting actually. I'm excited about a vacuum pump. <laughs> no, I could uh, check the condition of that diaphragm right away. I think I could do that. I think I'll do that right away. Um, oh, it's a one-time clippy clip, the clip face. I'll take it off this end if I can. Yeah. All right, here we go. Got the vacuum pump. Let's go ahead and slipper on there and the hose the wrong size. Okay. Can't do it today. I got to come up with an adapter. I think I should pull these off because I've seen guys pull these off before to gain clearance. Maybe I'll do that because I think you have to. Well, not yet. I'll see if I have to. I'll probably do every other. Yeah, I got to reorganize my wrenches. Can't work this dirty. Anyway, yeah, there's a lot of garbage in there, eh? Okay, well... I guess I'm just going to keep moving forward. Keep on swimming. Keep on swimming. Okay.